Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What are the potential impacts of Hurricane Milton, such as storm surge and flooding? Hurricane Milton, forecasted to make landfall on Florida's Gulf Coast, poses significant threats to the region, particularly in terms of storm surge and flooding. Storm surge is a major concern with Hurricane Milton. The National Hurricane Center has issued a storm surge warning for Florida's Gulf Coast from Flamingo to the Suwannee River, including the Tampa Bay area. This warning indicates the potential for life-threatening flooding from rising water moving inland from the coast. The storm surge is projected to be 10 feet or more, almost double that of Hurricane Helene, which recently affected the area. This level of surge could lead to extensive flooding in coastal and low-lying areas. Flooding. In addition to storm surge, Hurricane Milton is expected to bring substantial rainfall. The storm could produce 6 to 12 inches of rainfall across much of Florida, with the potential for flash flooding in areas beyond the immediate coastal regions. This rainfall, combined with the storm surge, will exacerbate flooding conditions. The heavy rain is anticipated to start as early as Sunday, with the most significant impacts expected late Tuesday or Wednesday. Due to the severe threats posed by Hurricane Milton, mandatory evacuations are likely to be ordered for Zones A, B, and C in Pinellas County. This is a more aggressive approach than during Hurricane Helene, when only Zone A was ordered to evacuate. Officials are urging residents to take these orders seriously to avoid another tragedy. Wind and other impacts, Hurricane Milton is currently a Category 2 storm, but is expected to rapidly strengthen into at least a Category 3 hurricane before landfall. The storm will bring high winds with sustained winds near 100 miles per hour and stronger gusts. These winds can cause significant damage and contribute to the overall destruction. Besides wind and flooding, there is also a risk of tornadoes and other severe weather conditions associated with major hurricanes. Preparation and response. To prepare for Hurricane Milton, residents are advised to have their hurricane plans in place and follow subsequent forecasts and official notices. State and local authorities, including Governor Ron DeSantis, have issued a state of emergency for 51 counties, and the National Guard has been recalled to assist in recovery efforts. Debris management. Ahead of the storm, all landfills and debris management sites have been directed to remain open 24 hours to expedite the clearing of debris. This is crucial as many areas are still recovering from the damage caused by Hurricane Helene. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below and feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.